beautiful people welcome back to authentically real with your girl no my time sign my phone dc aka noms welcome back to the returning subscribers <coughs> hi to the new subscribers <coughs> and hi to those of you who have not subscribed i don't know why you've not subscribed but please don't forget to like comment share my videos so guys you guys saw the title of today's video guys we are leveling up this 2024 mentally physically academically career-wise um so notice that there are many 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 people just like me who have studied accounting finance were in audit just in the commerce sector where we we all competing for like similar positions right guys like i decided to do a short course with the university of cape town in collaboration with get smarter with edx uh, you might ask why why uct why UCT in collaboration with Get Smarter and edX? Well, listen to this. Firstly, the University of Cape Town is the oldest university in South Africa. That's one. Secondly, the University of Cape Town has been ranked number one according to the top universities rankings that was done, a study that was done in 2019, right? Now, guys, why wouldn't you want that on your CV, right? Number three, Get Smarter is a tool that offers premium online short courses, right? Okay, so I know a lot of you guys that watch my channel are probably either in articles, either studying full-time or studying and working full-time. You know, with Get Smarter, you're able to attend these short courses online, saving a lot of time, a lot of petrol, and it's really convenient. Another thing is it's a three-month short course. So, so imagine being someone with that dot analysis course on your shoulder from UCT in collaboration with Get Smarter. Imagine having that course on your CV and being able to tell your employer that, no, that data that's coming in, I can sift that up. I can already put you at a competitive advantage compared to your peers. All you have to do is go on the Get Smarter website. This is the Get Smarter website. We're clicking on the University of Cape Town and guys, they have a number of courses from data analysis to compliance management to HR to tax law and accounting and labor law, guys. But we're focusing on data analysis. So guys, the course is eight weeks and it gives you an overview on the website. The course is currently 15900 but if you use my promo code NOMA2024, you will get a 20% discount off of all UCT short online courses. Let's level up this 2024 with UCT in collaboration with Get Smarter and edX. Okay, guys, so this year we are leveling up. So, guys, another way that I am thinking of, you know, elevating, um, like I said, academically and career-wise, you know, the short courses. I think, to be honest with you guys, I'm not going to lie. Um, a lot of you guys know I, I, I MIA'd in, in, in 2023, right? 2023, I MIA'd. I took some time. Um, it actually wasn't intentional, to be quite honest with you. <gasps> oh my gosh, many changes happened. I'm trying to, re I'm realizing now. A lot of changes happened in 2023. So maybe some of you don't know, probably a lot of you don't know. I was actually, I, I started my articles at a small firm whilst doing my CTA at the small firm. Um, and by the grace of God, I got an opportunity to move to a big four firm, right? So I think once I, you know, had to transition from the small firm to the big four firm, I think there was a lot of pressure in the sense that I wanted to claim RPL, to be very blunt with you guys. I wanted to get RPL. RPL stands for recognition of prior learning, meaning that whatever, if you move from one training office, so one company that offers psycho articles right so you move from there and you move to a different training office a different company whether it's audit uh training outside of public practice wherever it another thing is you know yo guys so like i was saying like you know moving from the small firm to the big firm it was very overwhelming so i decided to just take a bit of a break um in the year and and another thing i did to elevate myself was to go to therapy right so i touched this i touched on this briefly in one of my vlogs on how therapy has helped me because i think a lot of the times as people we don't see how things that affected us in our childhood or even now like traumas 
traumas don't just stop you know healing is a constant thing it's not just linear and healing is like this and it's a constant thing that you have to do over and over again right so one thing i noticed is that last year mm, I, I not even noticed last year i noticed a while back i just decided to actually get up and do something about it it was that i was affected in a lot of areas in my life because of my childhood or things that i went through and yes, it might not be as big as the person next door, but these things were still affecting me and how I showed up as a person today. Um, and I'm one of those, I like to journal, I like to introspect, all of that. So I think another thing that I did to level up uh, towards the end of last year and this year was to really, really engage in therapy. And firstly, I'm also going to speak on failure, right? Failing CTA. That can do a number on your confidence, on your self-worth if you see that your worth is if you're like you know some of us guys ish, i don't want to say life was smooth sailing ne? but when i i mean it in the academic sense that hey man matrick you did well in in high school you 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 were i wasn't i wouldn't say like i was a top achiever but like yeah no like shame i was that girl like yonki into i was that girl i was that girl academically i was that girl extramurally like i was that girl you know i believe i was that girl <laughs> so when you get to varsity you do well undergrad right okay you, you guys have seen my videos you know where the glitches were but i think for the most part like you do well you know and i think getting to a point where you fail chef you take it you fail again <laughs> yo it can do a number on one a person's confidence a person's self-worth you really start looking at wait wait where's my value where does that in who i am where does that lie you know so i think um therapy has helped me with regards to my failing cta i've never spoken about that on this channel so i feel like therapy has helped me in in regulating my emotions so i would also say leveling up um therapy wise um career wise i did say guys i am nearing the end of my training contract but not really because i told you guys i did move from a small firm to a big four firm but i'm not going to say when but yeah it's it's it is nearing or in the ca route right it's paved up for us so we know three years undergrad um postgrad is supposed to be one year or two year right two years depending on how what route you took or whatever postgrad one year right three year articles boom bam right but now it's it's as if your life is paved out there's been a step a direction even in audit the way we audit there, there there's a way there are eyes that that guide us in terms of how to audit there's ifris that tells us this is what accounting says it should be right so for so long in our lives from preschool primary high school varsity articles you've been guided you've been shown which way to go and it's like now i'm at a point where it's like, oh, no, 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 babes, you need to differ differentiate yourself from Bob, from Blue, from Mark, from Job. You need to be different because we all have, if I can say, I'm, I know our journeys are all different, but I mean, we all have the, the degree. We all have the postgraduate degree. We all have that similar experience. And I think it's now just a matter of how am I going to differentiate myself from Bob, Blue, everybody else. And short online courses in collaboration with Get Smarter and edX um is something that i do feel like you know i've been looking at short courses to just elevate myself to differentiate myself to to add to myself especially with articles which can be like very timely and tedious right um you want something short you don't want to be spending a year on 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 a course or on an uh, you know you guys get get what i'm saying you want something short quick i'm just focusing on getting this done and in my time managing my time that's why I also put focus on the whole thing of online courses, online, your time, you navigate uh, that whole aspect. So I think I'm at a point where I'm just like, how can I differentiate myself? Am I staying in audit? Am I moving out of audit? If I am, what skill set do I bring that's different if I'm moving out of audit? What skill set that I, do I bring that's different from Bob, who's from PwC and who has the exact same qualifications as i do what different skill set do i bring to the table what do i bring to the table you know so i think that's been a thought process that's on my mind like what do i bring to the table right so that's academic career right 
it, that's what's been happening on my mind, in my mind. Where am I going? Where to next? I've not been too stressed about it because articles has already just been a lot. Like I've just been swamped, but it is a thought. Then another thing I would also say is like being physical. Guys, like we're in our 20s, hey? I'm in my mid-20s. And I think genetically already, I don't think I, I gain weight or I lose weight quite quickly. I'm, my, my weight is maintained, but like, yay, things don't move as easy as they used to. So I feel like I'm also just like leveling up uh, physically, you know, even if it's getting a trainer, you know, getting someone you can gym with. Like there's people at the gym that you can gym with, you know, smile in them DMs, you know, be like, my, I would you want to jump together you know so i feel like that's something i've also just be like girl like let's take it seriously drink your water gym exercise like be active be active be active like let us level up yeah so guys i think that's the end of this video i just wanted to share ways in which a person can level up through your short online courses with the university of cape town in collaboration with Get Smart and Edics, otherwise mentally and emotionally, going to therapy, guys. Um, like, let's actually use the resources we have. Like, we have so many resources at, at the office, your medical aid. And like I said, uh, leveling up um, physically, going to the gym, exercising, going for marathons, runs with friends. Let's level up this 2024 with UCT in collaboration with Get Smarter and Edics. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And please don't forget to use my promo code NOMA2024. The link will be in my description. So click the link. View what different courses you that might actually appeal to you apart from data analysis. And, and apply. Apply, apply, apply as time is, you know, of the essence. But yeah, thank you, guys.